Hello everyone, welcome to the video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to power a car ready with a laptop charger. Any laptop charger, anything. Um, an old laptop charger, a new one, if you just want to buy one just for this, um, yeah, just for this task. But yeah, um, battery charger has to provide at least 12 volt to power, which most laptop chargers probably do. Which best laptop chargers I mean do provide 12 volts of power. So, yeah, there's the first two things you're gonna need, and the third thing you're gonna need is a pair of scissors or pliers. I suggest a pair of pliers, but um, I use a pair of scissors for this one because I don't have pliers, and um, yeah, so yeah, works the same, but yeah, whatever. Um, the fourth thing you're gonna need is duct tape or electrical tape. Which is what I don't have, but that doesn't really matter because I'm not going to be taping anything up. I'm just going to show you how I wire it up. But yeah, let's get into it. First thing you're going to need is to snip off this end bit right here, the bit that goes into the computer. You're going to snip that off. You're not going to want that anymore. And then you're going to get two wires right here. Let's wait for that to focus. If it will focus. No, it won't. So, yeah, whatever. You can still see them. So, you're going to have one wire, which is negative, and one wire, one wire that's positive. So, there we go. I got a negative, I got a positive. The way to find out which one's negative and which one's positive is on this block right here. Oh, laptop chargers have this block, this power brick, I mean, power block, whatever you want to call it, and it has all this info on the side. If yours doesn't have it, that means your laptop charger is really, really old, or someone's ripped it off. Or, I don't know, whatever other situation it would be. So, once it focuses, there it is. You're going to see this symbol right here. As you can see, there's an inner circle with an arrow pointing to the plus sign, which means that it's positive. Then there's an outer half circle that indicates that that is the negative so as you can see there's an arrow pointing to the negative sign which is which is the outer half circle so um yeah so as you can see that symbol symbolizes this thing right here so the inner circle is talking about which is that circle right there is a positive and this outer middle silver silver bit right here is a negative so obviously from common sense you're going to know that obviously the inner wire which is right here this white wire is a positive because on this thing right here it shows that the inner circle is the positive and because this is the inner wire this is going to be the positive and because the outer half circle is the negative the outer wire is going to be um, negative so yeah, that's how you get the positive and negative on laptop charger so yeah maybe yeah. you're gonna snip the end off and then strip it and then you're gonna get that so moving on to the uh radio power radio you're gonna ignore all of these wires right here the only wires you're gonna focus on is the black wire and the two wires here which is the yellow and red wire what you're gonna do with the uh, yellow and red wire you're gonna twist these together right you're gonna combine them then they're gonna become one because these are both positive so it doesn't really matter if you put them together because they're both positive anyway so nothing's going to happen there obviously this one black wire is the negative so what you're going to do obviously you're going to connect the negative to the black wire because that's the negative and then the, this white wire to the positive so yeah as you can see here this third wire here i've added an external wire because this is too short you know i can't really pull it anywhere to wire so added this external wire so I'm gonna put the other end connect this other end to the positive wire here so I want to do that and I can't do it with one hand so I'm gonna put the camera down just for a second and I'm gonna connect those so yeah just gonna positive positive negative to Negative. 
there we go so I've done it so I've connected the external wire which is connected to the two positive wires on the radio to the positive wire from the laptop charger and obviously I've connected the negative wire from the laptop charger to the negative wire on the car radio so what you're going to do now oh, so what you actually do is this part you'll tape them up and keep them separate because you don't want them to touch you don't want negative to touch positive because trust me you don't want to do that you're either going to blow this thing up which is going to happen most of the time you're extremely lucky if it doesn't or you're going to blow up your outlet which is this thing here that you're going to plug the uh, this thing into so yeah let's do that right now let's just plug this in here whatever way that goes in I'm going to plug that in there and then this should turn on some car radios have an on or off button this one doesn't so I'm just going to open it show you that it's on obviously you can see the lights there and um yeah hold on maybe this does have an on button I can't see the on button oh there it is so obviously you can see that that has turned on and um yeah you'll put like cds in it because this is a cd player and, you know whatever since that's on and uh, yeah well, yeah whatever and um that's all for today thanks for watching and um give it a like if you liked it if you didn't like it give it a dislike or don't like it at all but yeah whatever hope to you subscribe if you want to and um yeah I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.